My name is Maria Espinoza. I am co-founder and national director of the Remembrance Project. We honor and remember Americans who have been killed by illegal aliens. One of our projects is the Stolen Lights Quilt. We memorialize the victims on a six-foot long, digitally printed color. <coughs> and this is the way we place and are placing our families first. To honorable Governor Rick Perry and Attorney General Abbott, over the past five years, we have met with grief-stricken families, spoken to thousands of concerned citizens, public servants, sheriffs, and other law enforcement personnel, both on the border <coughs> and in the interior. As a result, we confirmed that American children and their families are, are being ignored. In Texas alone, there are thousands of family victims who have been pleading with their representatives at all levels of government who continue to be ignored. One needs only to look at the past to predict the future impacts of failing to protect our southern border. Crimes of murder, vehicular homicide, drunk driving killings, all preventable except for the lack of willingness of those who have been, we have entrusted with our lives. Politicians across Texas and America have thrown American citizens, our children, under the bus. Governor Perry, you must step up and answer this call quickly and with great regard for the safety and well-being of our children. Texas must act now because Washington, D.C. and the Obama administration have no regard for the safety of American children. How do we know? Because we met with Chairman Goodlatte last year. We also met with the Secretary of Homeland Security, Jay Johnson, and Eric Coulter in May. And our situation is much worse now. The protective hand our family, our children need will not be extended from Washington, D.C. If current laws have been upheld, the deaths of our children, our loved ones, would have been prevented. Five-year-old Felix de Leon, riding his back, was run over by a drunk illegal alien. Shatavia Anders was shot in the back and robbed by an illegal alien uh, murder. Felicia Ruiz, stabbed over 39 times by a man from Venezuela illegally in the country and still remains free to marry and raise daughters of his own. Jamil Shah, shot because he was black by an illegal alien previously jailed. Joshua Wilkerson, beaten, burned, choked, his body set on fire. The list goes on. Tessa, Drew, Danny Countryman, Lauren, all will be here today with their loving families if only current laws were upheld. So, Governor Perry and Attorney General Abbott, you have the opportunity to stop the pattern of killings, to stop the pattern of abuse by our government <coughs> upon American families. Governor Perry, Attorney General Abbott, you can and must immediately protect Texas families and ultimately all American families. Thank you.